democracy is under attack around the world, both internally from populist leaders who are turning their countries in undemocratic directions, and also externally from autocracies like Russia and the PRC. And we also see repression and human rights violations on a massive scale in Belarus, where the Lukashenko regime holds over 1,300 political prisoners unjustly, many simply for peacefully exercising their democratic rights. So President Biden has made it the centerpiece of his agenda both to strengthen democracy within the United States and to work as closely as possible with partners and close allies like Lithuania to combat threats to democracy around the world. Lithuania emerged from a brutal century of invasion and oppression to become a consistent defender of democracy, as well as a regional leader. It has successfully developed a vibrant, effective democracy, and through its values-based foreign policy has shown the world what it looks like to stand up for democratic principles and human rights against autocratic regimes such as Russia and the PRC. Our Lithuanian partners also support and provide refuge to Belarusian and Russian democratic forces in exile. Together with Lithuania, we support a democratic Belarus and call for the immediate release of all political prisoners. Democratic societies are freer societies, where honest discussion of our shared history is encouraged, and where we strive to treat all people fairly with equal protections under the law. No democracy is perfect, and every democracy demands constant work, including in the United States. In Lithuania, legal protection for LGBT individuals is a priority for that community as they fight for long overdue recognition of their human rights. We've seen the suffering caused by the Kremlin's brutal oppression of gay and transgender people in Russia. But by contrast, President Zelensky confirmed last August, during a time of war, that the Ukrainian government has, quote, worked out solutions regarding the legalization of registered civil partnership in Ukraine as part of the work on establishing and ensuring human rights and freedoms. For those same reasons, to ensure the human rights and freedoms of LGBT persons in Lithuania, the draft law on civil unions and its full consideration in Parliament is so important right now. And while the U Lithuanian government has made progress in addressing the legacy of the Holocaust with rising levels of anti-Semitism and Holocaust distortion in recent years, it's also critical for Lithuania to sustain its efforts towards accurate Holocaust history and restitution. Lithuania has made a remarkable transformation, becoming a strong defender of democracy after decades of struggling for its own independence and freedoms. The United States commends the people and government of Lithuania for their leadership, and we look forward to continuing to work with them on these important issues.